guys many of you guys were asking me to um, make new videos unfortunately i wasn't able to until now first i was waiting for this uh, little thing here from philips it's a uh, android tv plugged into the hdmi and um, with usb as a power source um, it comes with a new remote which is uh, compatible with the projector so you only need one remote for um, android tv and projector actually it's um, compatible really like the, the compatibility is done really nicely it feels like it's only one device um, you turn you turn it on here and the, the projector and the android tv start and also stop and you can switch over to projector menu settings with this button here so i first was waiting for this device and then um, i run out of time so but I thought I will still make one for you guys. I have my projector connected to the Bluetooth. There's the two buttons here. Um, and the connection, um, actually the connection is to this uh, speaker here. And this speaker connects with this speaker, which makes a beautiful stereo sound. So. Let's go ahead and turn on the projector. The projector in itself, it's a bit louder than what I was thinking it would be, like with the, the fan noises and everything. But once you're watching a, a video, you actually don't notice anymore. The projector is standing about one and a half remote control lengths from the, from the wall right now. And the picture is huge, like, it's, it's really perfect uh, for us. Um, I had the feeling when, I, when it was standing further away, then um, we were having some issues with blurriness. Now it doesn't feel like we have those anymore, except if the, the projector does an auto <laughs> focus that somehow is not working properly. If you ask me um, so we can go ahead and we can switch to the to the projector menu with this button for me go down and I will just go ahead and turn off the autofocus wait I think it's in this menu here geometry correction it's horrible as well um, and this one is off as well, but it's it's no big deal because you can set it yourself and I'm sure they will get better in the future um, There's a sub menu here for autofocus and for um, Everything and as you can see up here. I can't read anything down here. It's um, It's well focused and I can go ahead. I can try the autofocus one more time. It will try again now this time it did a much better job. Focus up here is good. Um, down here it got a bit worse. So you can go ahead and um, adjust it manually here and check in which direction you have to go. Um, for me, I think doing it once in the beginning or we are letting our projector stand here. We, we know where it has to stand more or less. And that's kind of enough for us now. Just gonna figure out what the best um, settings are. Okay, I think uh, now we're quite quite well focused. Um, I don't know. Maybe there's there will be more updates coming um, later on. Uh, that would kind of be nice, and um, then you don't have to do this. So here with this Android TV thing, I, I, I have no clue what it is. I couldn't find it online to buy it. It, it was a gift from Philips. Um, it's, it's a regular Android TV. You have all the um, normal Netflix, YouTube, Google Play muse, um, movies. And you have an Android TV Play Store kind of. I won't play any um, movies because of copyrights. Um, but I will play this here, I think. It's about um, doing a pilot's license, an exam. So you just 
that you can get a feeling of this. So now we have like the two speakers connected, instantly connecting. Um, Philips mentioned something about the delay um, with the, the sound and the, the movie, but I don't feel like I can hear it actually. It's just, um, yeah, it feels like there's no delay or it's not as bothering as I thought it could be. Um, to be honest, after having this projector for a few weeks, um, I decided I will not buy the U5, not because I would really love to try it, but because I think the U4 is really enough. It's like, it's a really cool projector. Um, we're very happy with it and I wouldn't trade it in anymore. I hope um, you guys enjoyed this review and let me know if you want to know something specific.